Like, it's just another fucking reinforcements that I have four turns left. I just, I, no. Alright, stealth has to. Oh, like, we have a move with her. Bring her okay, over here. I'll go. Oh, we got Adam. Adam has a turn still. He's got no one to shoot, though. I, I don't even, even think he can frag anybody. Hello, Move over here. I can't see anybody, so we're going to stay in Overwatch. This is pretty butt-clenching right now. Oh, there you go. There's our little shield, man. You can always trust on Zen. <laughs> Fuck that window. Zen even failed at fucking breaking that window anyways. Alright, we're taking we're taking this guy's ass out and we're running to the fucking relay, alright? Katarn says go fuck yourself. Welcome to Earth. Actually wait, he's been on Earth for a while. Alright, stealth. Into concealment. Yes, I know you're a ghost. Uh alright. That's a decent place. Fine, let's go here. I'm all over it. We need to get over there right away. I think we saw like a big ass guy. This thing looks ready to smash something. Is that an environment suit? Maybe something that can't handle our atmosphere? Those emissions could be toxic. I advise caution, Commander. Eyes on the target. I, I don't know about this fucking positioning on my sniper, but I think we're gonna just have to put up with it, guys. We, we just, we don't have enough time to fucking do anything here. We gotta fucking open up now. I, I'm actually taking a huge risk right now. Because I'm just, I, I'm literally about to kill zone these guys. But it's like, um, there's like 40, 50 of them or something. And I'm doing this now. Because <laughs> I, I don't think we have enough time. Like, I'm actually just going to send a rocket straight at them and just fucking deal with it. Let's do this one. Oh. At least they have to drop on the floor, I think. Some of them will. And then I'll throw like an ass grenade or something in. Because they know he's here, and they know he's flying. Especially this flying guy is going to completely fuck him. Unless I do that. Is he just dead? No, he's not. Yeah, these misses don't exactly help. I, I'm, I'm just hoping he's far enough away that it doesn't matter. Alright. We're going to overwatch. We're gonna throw a lava incendiary grenade in there. Actually, I probably could have gotten that dad too. Now I think about it. Did was that a dud? What the fuck's going on? Oh, okay, they they took damage. I, I guess that's a good sign. I'm <laughs> like a dud. I'm like no boom. Where was my boom? Holding. Okay, he's poisoned and he's burning. Like, he should be dead. Thank fuck for that. Adam got a promotion. That guy's dead too. Alright. Um, so I'm gonna fucking blow another hole in the side of that house. 
and we're gonna see if we can take some sniper shots at it. If we need to, like, if I can't deal with it this turn, then I don't think we'll be able to deal with it with the next turn. Because I don't think, I don't think stealth even sees it right now. Yeah, actually, no, no, this person sees it. Muton, no, uh, that guy, no, and that thing, yes. It's our last fucking shot, but we're gonna have to do it. Did we just, did we take it on one turn? I hope we did. No, one, one shot left. Okay, apparently no vision on the other thing. Uh, let's get a grenade in there, maybe. This is super risky, I know, but we gotta fucking deal with it. Wow, it's mutons galore, holy fuck. Mistakes may have been made. I don't, is this the guy that has like the big armor? I guess it is. Alright, we finally dealt with it so we can now play a little bit safer. Even though everybody already ran the fuck up here. Oh, did I just kill that guy? Nice. I think Kyle just got a fucking promotion from that. This is it, right? Uh, our good friend Overwatch here is gonna have to fucking. I I gotta move him up. I can't use aid protocol on this shit. Okay, stealth has to reload, and then Overwatch. Because she's probably gonna get revealed this turn. Uh, we got an acid grenade too, actually. Now I think about it. get up there and ask a grenade them. Like any kind of debuff works for me right now. Just something to prevent them from being like freely moving through here. You know? Well, I just like this was like probably really intense because it's just like fucking no time but like a lot of enemies. And I don't even know what the hell this guy does. Probably know he's just gonna smash all the cover and then we're fucked. Okay, good. He's fucking acid burning. Okay, so he's just gonna casually walk through the fucking acid. I mean, I guess it's this suit. He's got environmental immunity. Yeah, yeah, that would be it. And Adam just took a nasty shot to the face. Adam actually might be dead. Oh no, he's suppressed, it's okay. We're, we're okay with this, guys. Alright. Um, that, okay, literally there's nothing this sniper can do. I need to reload. It's possible I could fucking shoot with a pistol, but I don't know. Okay, let's see if Kyle can move up and possibly get a pistol shot off. Yes, he can. And he can also do it with lightning hands, too. Even better. I got two shots to kill him. Alright, we did it. Did you see that one? Alright, so, uh, how many people need healing here? Actually, not that in, in, in many, so I think we're gonna get... Go heal them. We're gonna get this guy, this bot thing, to go fucking heal him. And Adam's gonna move back. Because, amazingly enough, stealth is still in stealth. Not from the beginning of the mission, but, like, just, she's in stealth. That's all that matters. So, he can go back. Because I still have absolutely no idea what that guy's capabilities is. I'm gonna reload. Covering now. Overwatch. And Pat. Pat can shoot if he wants to. He's got nothing left for grenades. Okay, we're gonna reload him and then we're gonna overwatch. Alright, so let's see what this guy even does. Oh, fuck! That's not good. Oh, he's just gonna overwatch us. 
Well, I guess we'll fucking just shoot him then. What do we have for... Okay, we're gonna just fucking... Shoot him then, I guess. Uh, let's, uh, let's first spend the turn to fucking heal up, uh, stealth there. I couldn't move her, because it's just like, it's... She was in stealth, so it's like, what do you do? We got a nice chance to crit, though. So, I, I at the very least can fucking... Can I... Can I remove his, his fucking overwatch, though, is the question. Yeah, okay. Pat's gonna have to suppress. That I don't think that removes his overwatch, but I guess we'll see, won't we? You know, it does remove it. Got him covered. Which means now we can take some better positions. I don't know if I'm quite willing to do the crazy shit, like but let's see if let's see if we can make it work. Yeah, we're flanking now. The Tarn can't even see him, though. I can handle that. Yeah, I certainly hope he can handle that. I like I like his attitude, though. It's a good attitude. Good need. Fucking screen shake. Uh, one damage. I mean, pistol isn't very good against armor. That's the other thing I'm gonna say: the disadvantage of the gunslingers. I mean, he's kind of not doing anything, so... And we got like one turn until we can make more happen, so... I think he's pretty much a non-threat at this point, because we haven't suppressed, you know, everything like that. So we're gonna just not move. Because he's got like huge aim penalties right now, and doesn't know stealth is there, so he's just gonna fuck off then. Oh, man, this fucking one thing. Oh, I would have gotten this, too. Shit, I wanted this, actually. Or maybe I still get the chance to do it. Oh, I think we killed him. Good shit. X -ray neutralized. Which means we get the, uh, the thing, then, since he's dead. Unless he's not dead. We all saw that thing go down. Now what the hell is it doing? Okay, it's uh, not dead. It's got another health bar. He's fucking shooting now. Well, now the game's gonna take a nap. How's oh, that missed? And we're flanked. Did we shoot him? I, I, what, is, what is this thing even going to do? It's got no driver. I guess it's just autonomous or something. Oh, fuck. Adam, no. You were so young. Oh, it, it's like, it has like poison coming out of it. What the fuck? Wait, right, I think this thing is still up. No! Rest in peace is weapon. But there, there was an enemy that we weren't exactly familiar with. You could say it was enemy unknown. Eh? Ah, okay. like my jokes. Come on. Well, that, do that deals with that. Rip the mill. Uh, I got it, right? Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Well, that was very difficult, actually. That was much harder than I thought it would have been. But we did it, guys. Stealth actually did the most damage. Immediately, immediately when Stealth came out of Stealth, it's like, fucking, all bets were off. But I still really like her as a, um, kind of a, just like, give squad sight, essentially. Because my team is so long range, it's really nice, actually. Adam was the most under fire, that makes sense. Poor Adam. Holy shit, though. I think these missions are starting to get kind of tough, though. It's interesting. All right, let's go back here. I think I really want to make some of that fucking those plasma weapons, though. So let's possibly get that going. Adam is gravely wounded. He just got running gun. 
That's the fucking best. I want heavy ordnance on him. And Katarn got... Okay, so he can either have face-off. Uh, face-off is best augmented by aggressive field position. It's basically... He fires at every visible p uh, enemy with his pistol, opposed to kills them. So we're gonna learn face-off, because we're making him into a pistoler. And now we got a shit ton of stuff. Oh, there's the Andromeda Dawn autopsy. The beings that inhabit these suits come from an environment utterly hostile to humans. What? Oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Aggressive substance they use as a weapon may be equivalent to water for them. But this plan is deadly. Hello, Commander. Okay. That was fucking tough. Katarn has reduced well. Uh, and research speed increased by 14%. Now suddenly the bonuses have dropped for fucking the fucking lab. Or wait, what the hell? Wait, oh, no, no. Where's the fucking lab I had? Oh, yeah, right there. Okay, never mind. I'm like, 14% sounds like an awful lot. Like, 14%. But, yeah, it's fine. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Alright, what were we doing last time? I don't want intel. I, w I honestly want money. Which is why we were making contact in India. Setting course for the Indian regional zone. It's been so fucking long, I'm like, oh my god. It's like an hour later, it's like you gotta remember, it's like, what did I interrupt myself to fucking go do? Should give you a prompt or something, maybe. Defense facility now operational. Alright, let's view the facility. Oh, we got turrets now. This is not exactly what I thought of when I, I thought of defense matrix. This is turret defensive stats. That sounds utterly useless. In fact, the entire building, to me, seems kind of utterly useless. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I probably shouldn't have made it, but whatever. These are the lessons we learn, guys. In life. Let's go back to the, the thing. Alright, we got India, and we got fucking 60 supplies from this. What do we want to do now? I guess we can go make more contact, because, like, we got... I just have to make one more fucking contact, so... Actually, this guy can get his ass off this. And go man the fucking, um, resistance comms. Because I think, yeah... I think I built this, didn't I? And then I didn't fucking do it. Fucking plus four? Holy shit. Yeah, this stuff's the best. Reading you loud and clear. Make contact over here. For the West Asian corridor. I kind of want to make a fucking whatever that lab thing is. I need money so bad though. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. Yeah, look, more weapons we can't use. And we got Avin breakdown. Oh, we can complete that instantly. Complete that one instantly. Okay, dude, th th this looks so shitty. The Archons, fuck. The product of an extensive fusion of both alien biological materials and advanced mechanical support systems, the Archon is an unusually ornate design by alien standards. With an air of authority spurred by its distinctive appearance, I can only assume the aliens intended it to be something of a herald to the other forces. It certainly is impressive looking, if nothing else. Although I am still not entirely sure what the aliens hope to achieve, such a grand design. And now we have fusion blade. Alright, let's do some the Advent mech breakdown. These robotic units developed by Advent seem to be wholly autonomous, capable of targeting and engaging selected units without reliance on external verification. Although it falls on me to work through the initial disassembly. I fully intend on involving Shen in this process, as her knowledge of robotics far outweighs my own. Alright, what's this asshole give? Advent has legions of these mechanized units out there helping to keep the peace. As far as I can tell, they're fully automated and armed to the teeth. Gremlin pro- uh, uh, this blue screen protocol. So this is, um, greatly in increased the hacking stat, but many specialist abilities improve the effectiveness. Okay. Then, um, so I, so the, the Gremlin 2 also increases specialist abilities as well, depending upon certain ones, I guess. 
The number of mechanized units a Advent is, uh, is able to throw at us, developing munitions disable, uh, capable of dis disabling them should be one of our higher priorities. Okay. What do we want to research now? I don't want to fucking research that. Let's maybe just finish the storm gun or something, I don't know. Because then we want to do powered armor, I guess. I foresee a number of valuable applications stemming from this technology. I'll have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Let's keep going with us. We got a shredder gun. Inverse mounted slug thrower sprays a cone of razor sharp projectiles, damaging multiple enemies and shredding their armor. Dude, that sounds actually pretty good. Oh, wait, the avatar project just increased. Dude, it hasn't done this in ages, fuck. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. These findings will likely prove crucial to our ongoing efforts, Commander. Here we got the storm gun, now we just do the fucking powered armor. I'll see that work begins immediately, Commander. I'll contact you when I have a full report available. There's a lot less to research here, I've noticed. Okay, the, pow the co uh, power coil shielded. Oh. A new room is now available. Uh... Okay, so let's do the room. Maximum power consumption reached. Facilities built on shielded. They draw no power from the Avenger. And they uh, power relays. Okay, you know, let's just fucking build the shadow chamber here, except we have no supplies to do that. Because we do. Oh, that was the only one. Oh, we have another power coil right here. I don't think there's anything else I really need to make. The maximum power consumption. That's that's reached. literally it. Yeah, let's go excavate here then. Yeah, we got two people on that one. Alright, that looks pretty good to me. So yeah, we, we get a free, basically, shadow room or whatever. So I guess that's the equivalent of the vents. This one. Alright, now he knows fucking Void Rift. What else can I make him do? Uh, completely stuns target for one turn, but renders them immune to any dam uh, damage or attack. Uh, I'm surrounded by an aura that does the thing. Yeah, we know about the aura, and then a beam that of terrible power that damages every target passes through. Yeah, let's do that one. Uh, like, like it sounds like railguns. So railguns seems pretty good to me. It's gonna be a while before I can actually fucking use him because he's just he's so shitty compared to all my other fucking people right now. All right, let's have another look. Let's continue the map here. And now we get five more power, which is good. I can't believe I activated defense matrix. Signals coming through clear. All right, there we go. Five, plus five to power. Guess we're gonna go do a supply raid. Setting course for Eastern United States. I really would have liked to get like some of those better weapons, but like we're just low on supplies. I'm waiting for the next month to roll over because we're gonna get like a shitload of money. They can get like all those grenades and stuff. I know you guys probably want to see that stuff, but it's just like I have no money for it, so I will get it immediately when I get the supplies. Well, actually, maybe we can go to the black market. Let's try that, baby. Let me just quick save it before we end the episode. Cause it, what it, we got like 90 supplies, and like they wants like 300 for half that shit. The market is open. But it's usually pretty worthless. Like it's like, oh, 14, 3, 5, 4, 3, 5, 1, 3, okay, fuck this shit. Whatever, we're going back here. For the Eastern US Precinct. What is this, this is like a resistance mission or something, or what, what's going on here? I don't know, it's something. Raid the Advent Troop Transport. Okay, that sounds pretty good to me, but that will be for next game, guys, so remember, we will be watching. <laughs>